there's really two parts to the, uh, the process. The first part is actually at the tire pile, and that involves the tire bailing. Uh, there are three machines that are um, taking waste car or light truck tires, and they are being uh, put into this specialized uh, tire bale uh, machine, much like a trash compactor that uh, will take a hundred tires and compact it and then bind it with a nine gauge bailing wire into a rectangular block uh, that is 30 inches high, four feet by five feet. That tire bale weighs approximately a ton and has approximately a hundred tires in each bale. This tire bale is quite rectangular, so it's very easy in a equipment or road building sense to move it, to stack it, to haul it, and that's very attractive to us. You can take the delivery truck and pull it into the road right next to a log truck, and with its grapple hook, picks the bale up, uh, places it in the road profile where we want it, then we're using the donated bottom ash from PPNL. What we're trying to do with that is to isolate and stabilize those bales. And then shale is delivered and we start capping it. And then we will prepare for the final placement of the road surface, the driving surface aggregate that the state has developed that will handle the abuse, part of Pennsylvania's rural economy, but yet can be, and this is the key, can be easily and readily maintained by road crews with readily available equipment.